tea is one of the most popular drinks. It is not uncommon for people to always drink tea in the morning and afternoon. However, there is an assumption that drinking tea too often can damage the kidneys. Is that true? Caffeine in tea and coffee is known to have diuretic properties and can reduce kidney function. However, the International Journal of Clinical Practice shows no link between drinking coffee and the risk of chronic kidney disease. Basically, caffeine does have an effect on kidney health. However, if consumed in moderation, the effect will not be too significant. In addition to caffeine, tea drinks also have other content that is harmful to the kidneys. That content is oxalate. The Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics recommends consuming no more than 40 to 50 mg of oxalate per day. Consuming too much oxalate can lead to kidney stones, which can damage the kidneys by blocking urine flow. From the explanations above, it can be concluded that tea that has a high caffeine and oxalate content will be dangerous for the kidneys. One of the teas that is dangerous for the kidneys is black tea. This type of tea has high caffeine and oxalate content. Meanwhile, green tea is considered safer because it has a caffeine content of around 30 mg for an average 8 ounce cup. This type of tea is also considered very low in oxalate, which is less than 2 mg of oxalate per cup. Oolong tea is also considered safer than black tea because it has about 35 mg for an average 8 ounce cup. While the amount of oxalate it has is only about 1 mg per cup. From the data, green tea and oolong tea are safer to consume to avoid various kidney diseases. Even so, this daily consumption still needs to be considered and should not be excessive.